Yo, it's Amanda Dodd, and she's kinda odd, but hey, she's totally Amanda. No, no, it's fine. Sorry that the lighting changed, but this is just gonna have to do. We'll finish it out. I was just gonna say, okay, where am I? What is one talent that I have? Singing, obviously. <laughs> just kidding. Well, I mean, there's the obvious ones, like you, you dance for years. Not yeah. That you can never get it to, to dance for me. Okay, we're <laughs> over here now. I try. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> You can actually sing pretty well, too. No, I can't. This is a joke. No, you can sing pretty well. Ah, so tired. Not like that. Not like an idiot. No, you do sing. You sing nicely. Oh, that's sweet. Um, I don't think I can sing. What else? But... What else do you do? I mean, obviously, you're, you make <laughs> you videos, and, and you're good at that, and you're you're actually, uh, we're saying, what talent do you have? Like you're good in, you're good in front of people you're good at like present you're quiet but like you're quiet you're, if you're in a group of people you don't really like talk you just kind of sit back and chill kind of like i do a lot but yeah i do have a tendency to like i can find myself in any situation i'll just start blah, blah, you're blah, blah. way more talkative i feel yeah. like than i am like i just feel like it's not that i'm shy but i'm just you just hang back until i really get to know people they don't see like the true amanda right. like that well, you're, crazy well, that's what i'm saying you're, you're like me in the sense of if we're if we're in a situation, if I find myself in a situation, if I walk into a room and I don't know everybody, I I can talk to anybody in the room, but I do hang back more often yeah. rather than trying to like, you know, like you know those people that have to force their opinion in a conversation or force their ideas across. I don't really care if people are interested in my opinion or not. If yeah. you are terrific, we'll talk. Like mm -hmm. if you're not interested, I'm okay too. I, I just, just feel like I constantly back. find myself in situations where there are those people too. Right. So I'm just like. I'll let them have the floor. I can just observe. Yeah. So. I'll just listen to what you make yeah. a fool of yourself and I'll hang out. And if I have something to add to it, I will. Water. But, um, what talents do you have? You have so many talents. <sighs> Obviously, like you said before. Well, you're good at photography as well. You have a really oh, good... Thanks. How about that? Like, we'll preface it with, like, it, it comes out of videography and photography and all that stuff and, and oh. film and all that kind of stuff. But you have a good eye. Like, almost, like, yes. a, like, you have a good eye and better than I do in a lot of ways. You'll see things that I don't, like, necessarily pick up. It takes me a little while to, to see it. But, like, oh, we're out and we're, like, at, like, we're shooting pictures and whatever, you know. I'll um, splash a little idea in there yeah. here, too. Can you take it? Eye. But you're so good at executing it, and that's what I was going to say. Like, you're obviously, like, an amazing photographer. Um, but I was going to say musician, too, like you said before. I'm just gonna plug your band. No, great, thanks. <laughs> the Rebel Light. Check them out. They're awesome. Jack of all trades, master of yeah. none. That's what I am. Well, and another secret talent that you have too. What's that? You just know a lot of like random oh, facts. Oh, stupid facts. Yeah. Stupid thoughts well, you, and it, facts. You, it, That's what I do. You are intelligent, but that just makes you come across <laughs> even more intelligent. <laughs> like, you are intelligent. No, no, really, you're intelligent. Thanks. But you could like. I appreciate the but like you're co no, but you're so confident about like any stupid fact that it's like. Oh, shit, this guy ah, really knows what he's talking see, about. This is this is the key though. Like I, mm -hmm. I, was, I, I don't know where I've heard this before, but it's like it's like either you know something, you tell her when you eat what you know, like or you just pretend you know something and say it with conviction and people will believe you. There you go. So who knows if my facts are real? I don't even know if they're real. Anymore, so. <laughs> Stupid. But you know, I can it's still convincing enough. I can spat off that. enough facts so I'm like, I can get into a situation. I'll give don't you Google that. me though. <laughs> Whatever don't I'm Google saying. Me. You know, don't Google me. I mean like, don't Google what I'm saying. I get you. Yes. All right, um, what would I eat every day if I could? More food? I mean, that is my life. She's so. just eating food. Just all food. In general, all food. Oh, you eat, like, like, like a, something salty, then something sweet, then something yes, salty, and then something me. sweet. So, like, if we make it's dinner, cycle. it's immediately something sweet, like a Rice Krispie Street, which we <laughs> made the, <laughs> we unfortunately made the mistake of buying recently. Well, so, thank God we got the 30 pack and not the yeah. 60 pack because my ass is going to be huge by the time a this rice, portion's <laughs> over. A rice crispy treat. And then immediately day, before she can even a finish, it's like, can you get the bag of Doritos? I'm like, no, I can't get the bag of Doritos. You don't like, need Doritos. But then I, I don't like... need Doritos because <laughs> you have Doritos, it means I eat Doritos, and I certainly don't need Doritos. So, I'm sorry. Yes. Doritos, I think, would probably be the one, though. It's a bad habit. Doritos, not your Doritos. Just like, like chips, chips in general are like, yes. Go hang out with Tim. You and your chips. True. Um, what would yours be? Oh. A food that you would eat every day if you could? If I could, I'll jump ahead of you. If they could make a pill that would oh, replace yeah. eating. That's so seriously boring. Though, I know it is. I mean, I, I do like eating for fun, and I like cooking for fun. Um, like good sourdough it. bread, I would yeah. eat every day. That is good. I would eat good sourdough. I, I could eat something like a good sourdough bread over eating like sweets and crap like that. Like, I do enjoy it, and I... I eat it because it's there, but I don't need it. Whereas, like, if you give me, like, if you put a basket of, like, warm, good bread there, there's no chance I'm not eating it. Yeah. 
like restaurants and just yeah. devour that. I get the thing with the pill, but I I just really like food, so I, I feel like. But that's what I'm saying. Like this, uh, this is my argument with it. Like, I like if, if you could have, <laughs> if you could have a pill for two of your meals a day, if say you eat three meals a day, I don't know if you eat six meals a day. It depends on who you are, you know, whatever. Mm. But if you eat three meals a day, if I could have a pill for breakfast and lunch, or or lunch and dinner, or whatever, and just just pick one meal and eat that meal a day and make that like a like a an event. You know, like you cook dinner, become a thing, eat, sit down, eat, enjoy, save the food. Most people don't eat food that way because you just eat, you're shoveling garbage in your face all the time. Yeah. I enjoy Anyways, all of it. Move on. Okay. Dumb question. I <laughs> know. Some of these are really stupid. Um, what is my favorite cereal? Who cares? Mm, cinnamon Toast Crunch? I don't know. No. We have that. Probably Captain Crunch. Yeah, I've never had that. You're a weirdo. Yeah. You're just probably Special K. Never had Fruity Pebbles. You're insane. Never had Cocoa Puffs. I have to leave. <laughs> Actually, I did have Cocoa Puffs when I was 16 in England, and I what had about, it with like, Killian's Red. It's what? a beer. Like porter. Like a beer. Ew. Yeah, it was gross. Wait. Kind of ruined it for Wait. Me. You poured it in the cereal? Yeah. You're sick, man. Well, we didn't have any milk, and You're we were sick. 16. I'm sick. And? <laughs> and? and? Just eat country. it dry. We're out of the country, so of course you're going to drink. Yeah, drink. eat it dry. What is my favorite music? I guess like that could be like 60s, 70s, like like classic rock bands, yeah. like Journey, The Eagles. And who's like my some some of my favorite artists besides that? Maybe more like current. Oh, like obviously Demi Lovato. Ah, my queen. Who else? I'm like all all that. Guy. I'm a sucker for you. What the fuck's that? Jonas Brothers. Oh, Jonas Brothers. <laughs> That's right. Jonas Brothers, Demi Lovato, Mickey Mouse Club bullshit. That shit. Mickey Mouse. Hey. Uh, what else? Um. But then you also do like like Casey Musgraves and Chris. Yay! Chris Stapleton. Yeah. yeah. I like that. I love Yeah. You do like a lot of random stuff. It's weird though, because she likes a lot of really good music and then like a lot of cheesy music, so. I'm like Hannah Montana. <laughs> Last night when I was cooking, it was like Biggie Smalls to Hannah Montana. <laughs> that's not that's not a mix. Yeah, no one, it is. No that's one, like the best mix no of No one should life. ever have that mix. I need different genres. I like everything, so just give me it all. No. I would say yours is like alternative kind of like indie. Right. But Obviously, Pink whatever. Floyd, like Led Zeppelin. Yeah, the cla it's like classic. Your favorite of all 70s, time. 60s, 70s classic rock. I never yes. preface that you are a guitar player, so you dabble in some other instruments, but like, obviously, like Jimi Hendrix. Right. It is, it's weird. Like, I, I'd say, like, the biggest, like, focus thing, like, I, I influenced a lot by, like, Britpop from, like, the late mm. 90s, you know, stuff like that. I was never a big mob, like, um, Early two thousands American bands didn't really do it for me. I was living over in Ireland at the time, and I definitely prefer the English grittiness, the Brit pop, yeah, grit to it. Whereas American music's a little more polished and just I get it's that. that's like a polished turd. A polished like, turd? You ever hear that term? Like yes. You, you polish a turd, like you know, it's just it's basically what it is. A lot of that music is just like you're taking like some of the songs are really good, but like <laughs> my dad realistically, it's just like pristinely produced music, and it's just. It's not really about the song necessarily in the, at the end of the day. Some of it's just terrible. <laughs> sort of. Um, but like then I also really love jazz and blues and... But like current stuff? Anything. Current stuff right now? Weird. Like, I don't even know who I listen to right now. Who I listen to now? You kind of like listen to some of my stuff now. I do listen to some of that, but... Uh, I feel like you like... Ooh, um, good band from Philadelphia. Tam Paula. Tam Paula's awesome, obviously. And his uh, their band before that... Well, one of the band season before that was called Ponds. Oh, um, no. Pond or Ponds? I can't remember. Uh, ceramic animals, which are from Philly, they're kind of like a little psychedelic rock, yeah. kind of cool, kind of cool sound, kind of similar to Tame Impala, but more actually like the War on Drugs, who are also from Philly. So more of that kind of style of music, which is like Americana slash psychedelic kind of rock, which is kind of like the thing I, I think is big right now. Anyways, yeah. At least in my head, at least what I'm into personally. You like a lot of stuff like me though. We love yeah. Leon Bridges. Leon Bridges is awesome. A lot of like current R &B. people that we yeah. we kind of like together. Yeah. Casey and Chris. Anyone who can play an instrument yeah. and sing, I can appreciate. Mm -hmm. Or you don't have to sing, but you know what I mean. Okay. What else you got? What is my favorite sports team? I have a lot of people that I like. I do. I always get it wrong too. Like you like the Kings. <clears throat> Los Angeles Kings hockey. Right. Yes. Yes. And so that means you like the Angels. Correct. Because it's the baseball team. The Anna, well, that's Anaheim. Anaheim Angels, which are really the LA Angels, which just doesn't make well, any sense. Los Angeles of Anaheim. It's but stupid. you would think that I would like the Dodgers. So I know, it's, but it's, that's how I remember that. I'm you mostly like LA. Yeah. Well, oh, football, football, you like uh, the Saints, obviously. Fuck yeah. yeah. Saints <laughs> and USC. Who that? USC, yeah. right? SC uh, Trojans. 
Fight on, baby. <laughs> That's probably a chip for you, though, for sports-wise. No. Yeah. Lakers. Uh, Lakers. Kobe. Sure. R.I.P. Um, you're not, like, at... Your kind of sports, he's really into UFC. And your favorite fighter is Michael Bixby. Yeah, it's probably true, actually. Crushed it. I mean, he's <laughs> retired, but yeah. No, he's, no, probably, he's probably my favorite. Yeah, my favorite. Current? Current. Current? I just... I like... And you like I, everybody. I'm weird. I'm, I know. I'm like the Ma- worst. Max Holloway. I do like Max Light. Uh, Who's my favorite? I, you, well, you, um, let's think about this. You like Daniel Poirier. Yeah, I do, because he's You like from everyone Louisiana. from Louisiana. Um, <laughs> like boy. You also like Dustin Poirier. He's from Louisiana yeah. as well. I, I have a weird thing. Like, I, Who's I love. Who's my favorite favorite? Why can't I think about that? Ave Maria. <laughs> Who is it? Why can't I think? Brian Ortega. Oh, Brian Ortega. That's right. <laughs> T-City? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, T-City. T-City. Right. We enjoyed that together, though. Yeah. We went it's to nice. UFC 214 together. John Jones versus DC. Right. And Brian Ortega fought that night. That was actually a really good fight. And also, we went to Lomachenko that summer as well. We that did. was two summers ago. Boxing? Two? Yeah. Boxing's mm-hmm. good. I, I, like, I enjoy... I'd say sports-wise, I enjoy random... I grew up surfing. Yeah. I like mountain biking a lot. So, like, mm-hmm. I'll, wa- I'll watch... I'm probably the only person I know that actually watches downhill yeah. mountain biking. Yeah. But I do watch that. <laughs> random. On like Red Bull. <laughs> yeah. I'll watch that. I'll watch surfing sometimes. Oh, you've just been to watch the um, racing. Right. Yep. F1. It's not big in the States for the most part, obviously. But I mean, it's... You like other impressive. sports too. Like, you'll watch I do. it. Like, you like I the do. Giants. I like the Giants for my football team from growing up. Yeah. I just find it very hard to sit down and commit to following a season of football. Like, it's just, like, oh, cool, every Sunday and every Monday night I'm going to be doing You're this like, thing. And, and then I guess now Thursdays, too, with Amazon and whatnot. But, like, I just find it a very odd, like, thing, thing to be like, yeah, that. well, I mean, like, I mean, it's all, it's whatever you want to do, I don't care. Like, I just, for me, I'm just like, oh, I have to be doing this thing every Sunday for this entire, you know, few months, four or five yeah. months. You know, it's just kind of crazy. I'm like, I, I, when it comes to, like, a Saturday, I want to be in the mountains or doing yeah. anything. I don't know. We're kind of the same in that way, though. Like, yeah. we both enjoy, enjoy it, it, but though. I'm not, like... I need to see this. Yeah. Or else. I would like to watch it more, but it was we was kind of. Well, we don't have anything to really yeah. watch it on either. It's we true. don't have Football's cable. Weird. So. I'm not. I'm not. Well, and the, the Saints aren't work. fucking on anyways. Yeah. No, you can't get any. It's it's so irritating. Like you can't get anything from the East Coast or that that yeah. else, those conferences. You can't get that over here. What's my eye color? Funny. It's like hazily. Behind these hazel eyes. Yours are obviously blue. What kind of cake would you bake me on my birthday? A shit cake. <laughs> Actually, this is a shit cake. You see what I have to deal with? People of the internet. This is what I have to deal with. No, what's my favorite cake? I don't know. What's your favorite cake? Funfetti. What's <laughs> so good. Is that even what that is? You mean a confetti cake? Funfetti is what the is bombest I, cake. I know what a confetti cake is. That's what it is. A confetti? confetti? Yeah, it is. Right? Funfetti. It's like so you make a vanilla cake and you throw sprinkles in it basically to... No, it's it's pre-made. You just get it at Walmart. You get it at Ralph's. All right. Well, we'll have to pre- <laughs> preface this again with that my parents owned a bakery and I worked in a bakery for years. <laughs> I'm going to get so trash. So I <laughs> you can know make cakes and cakes. I don't buy crap cakes from crap store. Although... Those like frozen like I like don't get me wrong. What what I buy recently? Remember when I went to Whole Foods and I got the vanilla like yeah. pre-made cake mix? That's what I'm talking about. Like, it's but a I got the good cano- uh, cano- 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 coconut uh, based canola. Is that canola? Are you from Canada? <laughs> coconut <laughs> based. Um, it's, it's instead of instead of being made with shortening, it's made with coconut oil. Coconut. <laughs> and it's like uh, the chocolate <laughs> and the vanilla icing. Ooh. Well, that's what Those I ghetto cakes are good. Funfetti with um, obviously some bomb. Yes, it's it. That's what it is. It's just the vanilla with the sprinkles in it, but it's just pre-made. Lather it up with some um, vanilla. Lather it with the soap. Yeah, you okay. lather it. In. Shower. Or just like a white cake with vanilla chocolate cake? on top. Yeah. yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like <clears throat> you want like vanilla cake and chocolate frosting. Yeah. Simple. Bomb. Well, that was all cakes. But I make, what I make you recently though? Remember I picked up like the shortcake things. And we made I made strawberry shortcakes, like little baby ones. Oh yeah, those were nice those were with the fruits and stuff. With cool whip, cool whip, cool whip. Cool whip. It actually wasn't named cool whip. It was fake cool whip. What's your favorite cake? I don't really have one. Oh no, I know what it is. Mm. It took me a second. Mm. Ice cream cakes. Sure. I love ice cream Bomb. cake. I love all cake. I don't ice cream care. cake. Oh, I want cake now. For years, my mom would make me an ice cream cake for my birthday. Oh, Mint chocolate chip. So Ooh, that's the best ice cream. What can I spend hours doing? This is so easy. Sit on a couch? Yep. Being fast, sitting on the couch, watching TV, <laughs> eating. Uh, you could spend hours doing the same, but also just like up in the mountains, hiking, 
taking pictures. Pictures. That Actually, just that. like watching um, YouTube videos on photography, like all of your favorite pieces. Do that. But yeah, definitely. Um, activity wise, if I could be, like I said, I don't need much sleep, so I can be out like more up in Yosemite recently. Like I would, you would go to bed and I'd be up like shooting the stars, and then yeah. I go to bed and then I'm up at like. 6 a.m. Like, oh, let's go shoot sunrise, you know? Like, I can get... If I have something to get up for, I can get up. I need very little sleep when there's something interesting going on. Like, right now, it's kind of tough to be motivated to do much anything. I go to bed yeah. at, like, 5 a.m. every night because mm -hmm. I'm just the worst at going to I'm like a child. I can't go to sleep. So I go to bed at 5 a.m., wake up at 10 a.m. I can't do that. That's miserable. I need my sleep. I wish I could go to bed earlier, but I just can't do it. Okay. Next. Okay, if I could live anywhere, where would it be? Interesting. Hawaii. Oh, you know me so well. That's my favorite place yeah. in the world. Unfortunately, I wanted to go for my 30th birthday. Which Gotta is, be tough this year. It's coming up on June 30th, which is my golden birthday because it's 30 on the 30th. And I wanted to... What was that? One more time. 30 on the 30th of June. Um, I wanted to be in Hawaii because that's just my favorite place and you've never been. It would have been, been fun. I mean, maybe there's a slight chance. There's a slight chance. But, but it's not going to go anywhere. I know. We can always eventually. celebrate again. But yeah, I would say Hawaii or just like somewhere by the beach if I couldn't be in Hawaii. By the beach. I, I say the same for you or like we always fantasize about like going to Montana. You say Montana. It's not necessarily <laughs> Montana specifically, but the idea of Montana is nice. Like a, the cabin. Yeah. I mean, I know it's idealistic, but the cabin kind of idea like where you just... Kind of off the grid people, a no little offense, bit. But yeah. yeah. We don't like people. We've established that in our other videos. <sighs> I've lived in like three large cities. I'm from a small town originally, but even that would be insanely crowded during parts of the year. Mm. Um, but yeah, I definitely... Just to like escape Colorado, Colorado, We love places that have beautiful Idaho, nature and scenery. We love to be out Oregon. in nature. Yeah. I've one never been days. to Oregon. Yeah, one of these days we'll, we'll move someplace at least for a little while. Jump cut. There's a dog. There's a dog. We have a special guest. This is our baby Olive. She gets a little scared over weird things. Yeah, she might be a little nervous of us just talking because anything like out of the normal, she kind of gets like, "What are you doing?" We used doing? to watch fights. We used to watch UFC. We'd like rent pay per views. We or still boxing. do, but like we, at the no, beginning. no, we do. But I'm saying, like, when we used to like when we first started watching at home, she would just start shaking uncontrollably, and she would have to like same with football. sit on the couch with us. Anytime I'm like getting into it, I'm like, "No, wow, get She's up!" Gotten so much better about it now, but like this tonight it was kind of funny because I turned on the cameras and stuff, and she was definitely not feeling it. Oh, just chill with us, okay? It's okay, fine. Dog. Okay, I found some more questions. Are you ready? Okay. Okay, do we have a song? We got a couple songs. We do. What are they? The Bridges. Our first song ever, though, was Dick Haynes. Dick Haynes, uh, Where or When. Mm -hmm. That's our, that's our song that's song. That's our official song. I feel like it's our, our song song, too, because it's, it's not, like, a normal song for people. We're kind of, like, old school. Old school, yeah. So yeah. that's a nice... It's old school, like, jazz standard kind of thing. It's I mean, like, Sinatra's done it. Billy Holiday's done versions. Mm -hmm. Everyone's done versions of it. Really? But to, for some reason, like, his version, it's just, like, this big bandy, like, it's a good, good version of it. And but then, yeah, like you're saying, Leon, um... Somebody stinks. Did she fart? She fart. <laughs> you're stinky. There's some poopy pants over here. You to poop. You right there, bud? Oh. It's okay, TT. Why are you so shaky? No, no. And then what's the other one we have? We have Leon Bridges, uh, Beyond. Mm -hmm. <laughs> really? <laughs> when that album came out, you sent that song yeah. to me. You're like, I think I found like our our um, now song. Yeah, our like current. our current song. And, I'm like, and then that's who else? it. Chris Stapleton. Yes. What's that song you're called? <laughs> More. Yeah, that's a. That's a uh, why can't we? That's so weird. How we can't think of it. <laughs> Is it right then? More than this. Make me one more review. More review. God. God, you stink. Why are you farting? But those are our three songs. When was the first time um, you said I love you to me? Psychopath did it first. You're so mean to me. <laughs> it slipped out. Should I tell the story? No, oh, you can tell the story. <laughs> it's going to be less romantic. Oh, I smell it. I just I don't want. I was going to say, it's going to be a whole lot less romantic. The fart <laughs> smells. <laughs> You're nasty. Are you right, bud? What's the matter? Why do you look so sad? Oh, Do I lay down next to me? Yeah, go lay up like this. Um, what was the question? <laughs> oh, when I said I love you first. Your birthday. Mm -hmm. First year. 
I was feeling it for a while and I wanted to I say it. I feel like a lot of people always say like you should never tell your boyfriend you love them first. Like Especially you have to wait very... until they say it to you first. And I'm like, if I'm feeling something, I'm gonna say it. I didn't necessarily want it to come out the way that it did, but it just kind of slipped out. I was like, I don't love you. And then I was like, oh shit, it happened. <laughs> and I was like, I really do love you. No. And I really wasn't even expecting anything back. You ran out the door. Shut the hell up. You're like, I love you too. I don't think I cried like that, but okay. No, but you're like, I love you too, so. That was special. But yeah, yeah, whatever. That was cute. I don't care that I said it first. If you feel it, say it. Um, ooh, this is a good one. If I was any animal, what would it be? Dog. And? Sloth. Yeah. Or? Easy. Kind of like a dog. <laughs> a <dog. laughs> wolf? Yeah, those are my three spirit animals. That was simple. What the fuck is yours? I don't even know what your favorite animal. wrapped in a mystery. Yeah, what are you? I don't know. I feel like you'd I'm be. A vampire. You are. I say that all the time, but that's not an animal. A no. bat? No. It's tough in these times like to talk about bats. I love bats. They're so cute. I love baby bats. Don't bother me. I'm just saying that. Like, it's not you like wouldn't a be a bat. I feel like you'd be like a mountain lion or something. Wow. <laughs> we're weird, huh? I know. The dog doesn't understand that we're talking to nobody. What would you be? What would I be, Olive? What would I be? What do you feel like it would be? What do you feel in your soul is your animal? Fly like an eagle until I'm free. Fly Probably, like somewhere, I mean, if I had a choice of things to be, like, you know how you always get those stupid questions that people give you? Yeah. Ring, ring, ring. Like, I would be a some kind of large bird. Okay. Just because, I mean, how awesome do you fly? I like sharks too. Sharks are cool. I mean, whatever. I mean, yeah, I'd be a shark. Dolphins are fun, but I definitely... A bird. Bird. I'll take sure. um, Not like a crappy little bird, though. I want to be a big bird. <laughs> Badass bird. Exactly. What is your favorite thing about you? Hmm. This dog. What? That's yeah. like a part of me. Like, That's a part of you right there. What's your favorite part of me? What, what you mean physical? Well, you could say that too. You're just a lot more mature for your age and relationship experience. Oh. I guess is the best way to put it. Like most ladies and guys as well, they're fucking psycho. Like, you know, like, like people get jealous over the stupidest shit. It's just like, I've always just, I don't know, to me, I like, like a, I'm friends with exes and stuff like that. That's never bothered you. You're just like, cool. If it was a problem, you tell me. But like, like, it's just like, you're just like, Walk up, give them a hug, and say hi, and that's it. Like it just—it's just weird. Like I never, I've never understood people's like crazy like jealousies and all that other garbage. It doesn't make sense to me. So that's that's my favorite thing. Aww, I think just because it's just that's a personality thing. Like I just I just don't. Under, it doesn't. I'm chill. It doesn't make sense to me that people are like that. If you know what I mean. Hi puppy. I know my favorite thing about What's you. My wine. Oh right yeah. Do you want more? You can do this while we talk. Oh hell yeah! Do I want more? Screw cap. Really? I know, it was so easy to open. I know, it was just I, know. I should have known screw. that you were going to do that. <laughs> I actually didn't know that it was at first. I went for the opener and then it was like screw top. Uh oh, I'm not dripping, I think. You're okay, TT. Oh, all the licks, thank you. Do you want some more? Why is that for dogs? We're going to get zooted. Should I just get the rest? Sure. Hi, buddy, what's up? This is riveting entertainment. We haven't had dinner yet either. I feel like I'm going to get buzzed after this last. It's okay, bud. Well, my favorite thing about you is probably just... The way that you make me feel. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> to branch off of that, though, it's just like you're such a caring individual, not only to me, but to everybody else around you. Yeah, I hate everybody. It's amazing. I know, but I'm, <laughs> I, I don't like people, too. But I, we're like the nicest people to people, though. But like, we're just like... Yeah, we like to be on our own. But you're such a caring person. And it's been like, like that day... What? It's been that way since day one. It's been like that day. It's been like that since day one. I don't know. That just means a lot to me. Well, I guess that is all for this video. We answered a shit ton of questions. I don't know if all of them are going to make it, but I hope you enjoyed the ones that did mm -hmm. and you got to know us a little bit better. But Sorry, the scene changes here. Oh, yeah. That's okay, though. Continuity problems. Yeah, but it's okay. No dog. Dog. <laughs> let on. Let off. She but, was laying in the clothing basket before. Oh, Puppy she girl. got nervous. But this was fun. I think that sure. we should do more videos. Mm -hmm. If you guys like them, let me know. If you have any other suggestions of videos that we can make together, we're down. 
Ain't got nothing else to do in this quarantine. Quarantine? <laughs> quarantine. Quarantine. Ooh. Quarantine. Um, Quite it. Copyright. Copyright. <laughs> Anyways, I love ya. Me too. Happy almost anniversary. Mm. Cheers. <laughs> You're Cheers. sad with me. Yeah. Thanks for watching this video, guys. I'll see you in my next one. Peace. You should say it with me. Right? Peace. Peace. <laughs>